Hi guys, good morning. Um, I'm here with a promised video. Uh, welcome to my altar, my messy altar. Um, I got my coffee. This is literally my first morning coffee, which I'm gonna take a sip of. Excuse any possible noises. I have my door to my balcony open because I need some fresh air. And I've been dying to open this deck since yesterday, since I got since I got it, but I didn't have time yesterday to open it on camera, so I am doing it right now. Let me just get this plastic wrap off. So I've seen a couple of images of the cards, but I haven't seen them all. So this is going to be an interesting unboxing for me. And I am just excited about this deck. Oh, look at this. Beautiful. Heal yourself, heal the earth. I love it. This deck, I imagine it's gonna be a freaking dream to work with when it comes to body image work. And of course, Ma Mari, I believe that's what, how her name is pronounced. Mari is an absolute sweetheart. Like, she's, um, she's really like, just an amazing person, sweet, kind, down to earth, uh, and it reflects in the deck. So, let's see. Oh, I love this. 10% of the proceeds from this deck will be donated to ocean and climate change research. Yes, see, this woman is amazing. Let's open it. Oh, let me just show you. Like, there's a little note that she sent, but I'm not gonna be showing you that. But she sent me look, this. It's so cute. I believe this is a sticker. Or maybe it's not, but either way, I'm keeping it because it's freaking adorable. I might, like, stick it in my journal or something. And this gorgeous, gorgeous postcard, which I'm probably gonna frame because I love this image. This image speaks so much to me about you know, like holding your own cup, embracing your own self, making sure that your own cup is is full before you can, you know, give to others. This might not be the meaning of, of the card in the deck because I think this, this image is in one of the cards. Might be the Ace of Cups. But this is what it like what it says to me and it's it like just screams self care to me, you know. So yeah, definitely want to frame this, put this up on my wall in my kitchen or something. Okay, let's open this. Oh, it has a rainbow on the side. That's so pretty. Gorgeous. 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 See? Perfect little guidebook. I love guidebooks like this. It's not too big, but it's still not like the little white book or whatever. It's chunky. Um, yeah, I'm not going to be reading any of this on the camera for you guys and you know whenever I watch unboxings of other people I'm like just skipping through the part usually well not always like I like to see at least how the guidebook is laid out but like I don't want to be like listening anyone reading from the guidebook for me so I'm not gonna do that <laughs> mm -hmm. she has them like divided by the elements and there's color coding involved which I love I love this. I'm so gonna be reading this later today. 
And I'm just so freaking happy that, you know, donation, like, portion of the proceeds goes to, you know, helping, helping the earth. That's awesome. Okay, so some simple spreads. It's nice. And then the card meanings. Ah, oh, I love this. It's not, you know, overflowing with information, which I, I don't think that this deck even needs it, to be completely honest. I will appreciate this to see what she was, you know, envisioning um, as she was painting this deck or drawing this deck. But I, I think that, you know, the imagery of this deck on, in itself just allows for a lot of intuitive reading. Let me just get this out. Okay. Oh, stay wild, their heart. That's so pretty. That's so cute. It has this beautiful matte gilding. I am living for this. I'm sorry about the lighting. I have my roof window just like almost above me and it's a cloud it's cloudy weather outside so but yeah look at this i love this so pretty see ah oh, it is the ace of cups awesome okay so i'm just gonna flip through the deck oh i love this this is like you know watering each other's heart <laughs> nourishing each other i love this so much this reminds me of my coven so much. So nice. I can definitely, you know, feel the meanings of these cards without even thinking about it. And that's what I love. Yeah, that's beautiful. I love this. Yeah, she's drinking from that last cup, whatever is left, and then moving on, leaving it behind, moving into the new adventure. So pretty. Oh, I love this. Look at him. Come on. How freaking adorable is this? Are you kidding me? So I think that the animal cards will be more the ones which I need to like read about in the guidebook oh, I love him. so strong and yet gentle okay so interesting that it starts with a like like the suit of cups and then goes into the major arcana and then it goes into other three suits. Kind of interesting. But okay. So here we have the full. I love this. I love this image. It's just so full of symbolism. And I could just like stare at it and try to decode everything. <laughs> I love this. To me, this is like, you know fully embodying yourself standing in your power no matter what the what the circumstances are connecting the body and spirit i love it the high priestess is the owl of course i love it if you ever met an owl at night it can be scary as shit <laughs> But also beautiful. 
Oh, I love this. Look at the little birdies and the butterfly. Beautiful. I love this. So such a like such such an abundant image, right? The emperor proud with his head high. <laughs> Hierophant. So pretty how she managed to draw like the little you know colorful reflections in the feathers. So pretty. Oh, I think that she has created a new lover's card um, because, you know, some of the tarot readers aren't, you know, you know, there's a, a whole thing with the gender and the, um, what is it called? Fuck. My brain isn't working yet. I still need more coffee. But basically straight couples or whatever. Uh, and I'm not saying this in a demeaning type of way. Um, I'm not straight myself, so. <laughs> um, but uh, I know it's going to be more usable for people who might not be straight, who might not be, you know, cisgendered or whatever. Um I, and I think that the new lovers have two butterflies and it's still beautiful. But I also appreciate this as just, you know, <laughs> my first association is me and my partner. And yeah, I love it. I love it. Oh, I believe I haven't seen this before. Oh, I love this. I can't wait to start working with it and just like read a little bit in the guidebook about what what she meant with it so i can see that the majors are mainly animals and i love this so freaking much i love whales and i just tend to love all big animals like elephants whales i don't know bears i just feel like they're misunderstood and you know feared for their size but they're gentle giants and i love that Oh my god, it's a little foxy. I love this. <laughs> and I really appreciate this Wheel of Fortune. It's simple, but it represents a lot. I don't understand this card, but there are like two pouches like or two mojo bags or something. Could be like two bags with seeds. I can see that there are seeds in the bottom. Some of them are sprouting. Some of them aren't yet. Um, and I have to read about this. Like what are these thingies? But maybe these are just um, determining. Like which seeds will get to take root. And which, which won't. Or something along the lines. I don't know. That's my first association. I'm going to have to look into the guidebook for that one. And this is my like... <laughs> This is one of the cards that really made me, you know, want this deck. <laughs> Look at this. I love this so freaking much. This to me is like screaming like full of full acceptance of of my body and just like embodying myself fully and just like being free, feeling free in my body, feeling you know, <laughs> at home in my body and just letting it all go like letting it you know letting all the fucking prejudice and all the fucking ways that it should be go that that's what this is to me it's just pure joy <laughs> i don't know i love this card i love it i have to see what she wrote in a guidebook but i love this I love this too. Hermit crab this has outgrown his old shell, so he needs to move into a new one. Although it's scary and dangerous, you know. Oh. I'm not gonna comment on every freaking card because this is gonna take forever. <laughs> but I I am really enjoying the artwork. It's gentle, but it's also striking and 
powerful. I don't know, it just hits something. Hits the spot for me. Stunning. This, I want to read about this. I've, I've heard an explanation of this before, and I, I, I remember that I really loved it, but, like, I forgot what it was. But, uh, yeah, I like it. Oh, nice. And this is literally what my body looks like right now, <laughs> and I appreciate that. <laughs> I love this. Look at this. This is so nice. <laughs> oh. oh, I love this. Look at this. I'm just gonna stop saying that I love this because I just repeating I'm just repeating myself, but I really do. I feel like this deck could also be amazing for working, you know, with my inner child. Oh, okay, so this is the image from the box. I love this image. I've seen this image before and it's so interesting and striking. I'm really curious to see what she says in the guidebook about it. I'm just adoring the colors that she chose. They're so like earthy, grounding. Oh, nice. This looks like rosemary, but then it has like this little balls on top. I'm gonna ask her what this is. Huh. Or maybe it's in the guy book. You know, there are more of these plants. I love this. And here we are back at the Ace of Cups. So 
So that's it for my unboxing. I'm now going to go enjoy my coffee and enjoy this deck a little bit more. And yeah, I look forward to working with this deck, especially for, as I said, for some self-healing, self-care, um, some body work, you know. This, these are the bags. Stunning. Okay, okay. So, I think it's safe to say that, you know, if you like what you see, go... Go get yourself this deck. I'm gonna try to see um, if I can get a link or something. Yeah, I'm gonna try to find the link to her shop and link it down below so you can go check it out. And check, go check her out on Instagram. And yeah, support support um, smart built businesses, right? Um, and support just freaking amazing art. Yeah? Yeah, okay. <laughs> So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.